With the launch of the first Do It Best store by the National Hardware Group of Companies, Chairman Edward Boyer believes it will significantly improve the construction and building sector. For decades, National Hardware has been producing and importing products for the construction of buildings. The Do It Best store is located opposite the National Hardware Supercenter store at Rumvelt Industrial Site in Georgetown, and according to Boyer, it is an investment of over $400 million. We are comfortable that we'll be expanding with this kind of uh, atmosphere. We've brought in the new programs. We have a full new programs to get you in and out of uh, the stores quicker. Also speaking at the event was Minister of Tourism, Industry and Commerce, Onej Waldron, who noted that National Hardware can also partner with local companies to help develop, promote and showcase locally manufactured building products. The expansion of this icon of the dining business landscape supports and complements government's development plans. And I wish today to highlight two objectives of government for which this event holds special significance. The first objective that is impacted by this expansion of national hardware and others like it is government's resolve that every dining should be able to realize the dream of owning their own home. Meanwhile, President of the Georgetown Chamber of Commerce and Industry, Timothy Tucker, in his remarks, said this investment is a testament that the National Hardware Group is committed to the development of Guyana and building the local private sector. Tucker also used the opportunity to call on the government to fast-track the e-commerce legislation to allow for the use of multiple debit cards. Meanwhile, President of the American Chamber of Commerce, Devendra Kisun, said they are proud to witness the growth of the partnership with a Guyanese company and an American company. The Do It Best store promises to make customers' experience effortless and efficient. Reporting for the newsroom, I am Isanella Patwo.